Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Hello stranger, it's been a minute since So good morning guys. I feel like it's been a long time no see. Probably not to y'all if I do post this other vlog that I recorded some days ago. I just have not edited it. I just have not edited, edited it, however you say it. Um, your girl just been having some very emotional, personal, shitty days, honestly. So yeah, I recorded a clip. We went to go see the uh, new Spider-Man movie, like the night of, like when they released it. And I'll include it here. Okay, hey guys, it is. Friday, December 17th, it is 2.15 in the morning. And I had to come home and just have a lot of emotions going through my body right now. So, I am up this late and just got home this late because we went to go see the new Spider-Man. And yeah, we saw it. Well, we went Thursday at 11 and it's, oh, it's two now, 2.15 now. What time did the movie end? It was two hours and a half long. And you know, I just like watch a movie and y'all have just like so many emotions going on afterwards and you just like thinking, you start evolving in your life and think about your life and everything. Like that's what I'm going through right now. <laughs> so yeah, we seen the third Spider-Man with, um, with Tom, what is it called? No Way Home? Yeah, and oh my gosh, y'all. If y'all don't watch Spider-Man, I definitely like recommend, if y'all ever have any free time, any free time, just watch all the Spider-Man movies. Or, or just watch Tom or whoever character y'all wanna watch. Like, just watch any Spider-Man movie and y'all watch this movie y'all gonna love it. I was, should I say that? Yeah, I was bawling my eyes out. I definitely said that was like, the best movie I've seen since Joker. For real? Yes. What other amazing movie have we seen like that? You mean like uh, Far From Home? That was better than Far From Home, babe. <laughs> no, I'm saying. Yeah, I liked it, but I I'm saying. Far From Home after Joker, right? I know, but I'm saying like since Joker, like I like that movie. Like that was like a good movie. Like that was a top-notch movie. Like if y'all have not gotten to Spider-Man, like. Honestly, I recommend all the Marvel movies. I feel like they're all good. They all have like either like good their own stories or like combined stories. Like they're pretty good movies if y'all not interested in stuff like that. Like that was a good movie. Like I'm over here. Like y'all know it's a good movie. If y'all watch a movie and y'all just like thinking about stuff afterwards, like that was a good freaking movie. Um like I've like my boyfriend's always, you know, when we got together, he likes Marvel movies. My sister, she watched them too. And I just never was like, oh, you know, superheroes, supervillains, like that. And, you know, he used to always just want me to watch it because he just felt like, he, you know, I would just like it or whatever. And just like to put me on. And after watching that, I feel his, I feel what he felt because I just want to put everybody on. Like, like, those are some good movies. And that last movie... The one we just seen, that's like, that movie is so good. Like, that's my favorite movie now. It's like the best movie I've seen in some years. Like, it's really good. So, if y'all don't watch Spider-Man, go watch Spider-Man. Um, now I'm gonna spoil it, but that, that movie was really, really good. It was worth the two hours and a half long, but. <laughs> my hair do look crazy. Sorry if the light is weird in here, y'all, you know. It's, yeah, it's really yellow. But, um, yeah, my closet now. My closet has still been clean from when I cleaned it. I recorded, I vlogged, um, the last vlog I said that I haven't posted yet. Um, that vlog, I cleaned my closet because it was looking a mess. It was embarrassing. And it's been clean ever since, but that's because I ain't been going nowhere. I just been going to work, so that makes sense. But let me put on some clothes so I can go out because, yeah, and it's cold outside, y'all. Cold. I wonder if like like y'all watching out here if y'all don't stay in Texas like what is cold to y'all it's 49 I, yeah last time I checked it I think it was 49 
It's 49 degrees cold to y'all. That's like cold to us. Like, I was 48, 48 degrees. 48 degrees is cold, okay? It's cold here in Texas. It's 48 degrees. It's cold. Trying to see if I should just throw a jacket on. If I should just put on. Maybe I should put this Sherpa jacket on. I showed this Sherpa jacket that I got from um, Victoria's Secret. And it's huge. I think it's huge. But you know, I was thinking after I recorded that and I was editing it. What if it's not big on me? What if I put that jacket on and it's not huge on me? The pain I'm going to feel. <laughs> oh. I don't even want to do that right now. Matter of fact, now that I'm thinking about, it, I'm not even finna. I'm not even finna do that to myself right now. So never mind. So yeah, now it's unboxing time, unpacking time. Um, so the first item I got, I wanted a Christmas sweater. We're allowed to wear Christmas sweaters to our little like Christmas potluck food thing they have at my job. And then also on Christmas Eve, if you work on Christmas Eve. So it's a sweatshirt too, so it's more comfortable. Let's see how big it is. Oh yeah, and I thought about not just wearing this for work. I can wear this out. So it's a sweatshirt and it says, Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas. And it's cute, right? So yeah, I thought that was cute. And I'd wear this to just throw on sometimes. Next, next package. This is beautiful. Look at that. Just really nicely well packaged. <laughs> This is from Shein, Shein, however you say it. Um, one of these things in here is, or well, a couple of things, is Christmas gifts. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put that to the side. This box is beat up. Well, I could show y'all. So, these are cute. So, my mother has been into mules. I'm sure she won't see this, and I probably post this after Christmas, so we'll see. But my mother's been really into mules, so I got her some off of uh, Shein. They had a whole bunch of cute ones, so I got her a pair. So I got a whole bunch of small things for uh, as gifts, and then for me. So go ahead and show y'all. Um, but yeah, so I got this one. This is for my sister really cute it has the hearts and the little eye long around the thing too and then i also got this one this one's for me i thought this was cute it has like the smiley faces but it's like that pink color it's like my favorite color with that thing with that thing around the thing uh where is the border thing and it looks like that now i want to put that on but i just put this one on so i'm gonna wait my sister has an obsessed with cow print so i was like this would be perfect so i got her this phone case really cute so I got those <laughs> isn't that so cute oh my gosh that's so cute look at that y'all look at that that's so cute I don't like things like that okay but yeah that's cute look at this y'all just look at this oh my gosh is it all right I thought that was cute so yeah I got that so Again, if y'all want some cute phone cases for cheap, this probably was like three dollars because it's like extra with the chain and everything. But most of the everybody cases like a dollar, dollar fifty, two dollars, two dollars fifty, three dollars. So yeah. So yeah, I got that. That's really cute. Um, so another thing I got. So I saw this girl on TikTok. I know, just so influenced by TikTok. 
um she had got like her own perfume bottles like kind of like chanel looking ones themes and filled them up with her perfumes and like labeled them or just like she just knew i believe i've seen like two videos like this already so and she had like a little little a little tray she put in the restroom and she, or no on her dresser i'm probably thinking of both videos but the one i'm talking about was on the dresser she put a little tray and she had put them and i think she labeled those that was the video she labeled them and they just look better they match instead of all the different like looking bottles and stuff i thought that was so cute i'm not gonna be extra and do all that and i don't even have i don't even have any designer perfumes the only designer perfume i have is mark jacobs daisy other than that, I use like other regular ones. Like, I don't have no more Bath and Body, but I throw them all away because they were, I think they were expired if I'm not mistaken. But I have one that's from Pink called Warm and Cozy. I love that smell. So I use that one a lot. So, but yeah, so when I saw that, I thought that was so cute. So I was she in, this popped up, and I was like, that's how this video is a while ago, y'all. And I saw this and I was like, oh, that's cute. I could do that for my one perfume I do wear. So I got this. It's small though. I didn't I didn't know. I don't I still don't know the size and everything. I don't go buy perfume like that. Hopefully my mom, my sister, they've been really into perfume, so I'm sure they I'm sure they bought me some perfume from Christmas. So I mean maybe I could order me some more. But yeah, I got this. Uh, this is really cute. They also had one that was all black. I should have got that and I'm thinking about it just because there's like black accents in the restroom. Because I probably put this on a little tray thing I have in there. But yeah, I got this. It's really cute. Little perfume bottle. I don't know how many ounces this is, but it has like a little pump in there and everything. And this comes off and then you just pump it and spray. So I'm going to put my pink and cozy um, in this. I thought that was perfect just because it's like a, it's like a, not, not even Victoria's Secret. It's, it's Victoria's Secret, but it's pink. Like, you know, the P-I-N-K um, brand and they be on stuff like six dollars so i was like that's perfect to put in like to make it look nice in this you know you know what i'm saying y'all have to of course like maybe some people won't agree to take it out they're like branded uh perfume bottles because they're like a designer brand but i think it's perfect for that for that case because i really like the perfume it's, it smells so good i mean the body spray so i thought i'd put it in here and i put it in here it's a perfume there right <laughs> no <laughs> But yes, I got that. That was really cute. I'm going to do that in a little bit and then put it on the little tray thing. Okay, so now I'm moving on to little makeup things I got. They're like little four things dealing with makeup, around makeup. So uh, these pop up a lot. These are popping up a lot. So I was like, oh, I might as well give me one for whenever I, you know, I start doing makeup or whatever. So I got this, the little headband that you use to like pull your hair back. This stinks. I have to wash this. But yeah, I got this. So I thought that was cute. Got this little brown like grayish brown nude color if that makes sense taupe color so yeah i got that it's cute so yeah so i got that um okay. another thing i got after that like a whole bunch of makeup stuff was popping up so i was like might as well so it's this little heart thing tray they have on sheen i had a whole bunch of different shapes i just got the heart one at the heart was cute there's like these little fiber things on them that are like stuck on it have to wash it off but it's like this and then you put it on your hand like this and you hold it like this i think if i'm doing this right i put my finger through there like that but yeah it's like this it's like a little tray you can like pour makeup on here if you have to put something on here and um pick it up with like a beauty blender or a brush so i thought that was cool i put my foundation on here and mix it probably and just you know instead of put it on my hand so yeah i thought it was cool it's cute the heart shape yeah that was like a dollar <laughs> so i got this it's a beauty blender on a stick instead of like holding a beauty blender i got one on a stick and i want to try it out to see i don't know if this is like clean or safe to use because i don't know but i'm gonna try it whatever why not so yeah i got that it's smaller than what i thought it was gonna be maybe it'd be better to be like more precise but yeah i got this beauty blender on a stick that was cool it's cute too so got that i'm gonna try it out so I saw this. I said, okay, that'd be cool to have too, because I felt weird. Because um, my I, when I first did my makeup, I had a beauty blender, and I didn't know what to do with it, like where to put it, like just leave it out in the air. So I also saw this on there. I said, okay, I might as well get that then. And this was the picture, like it had something inside of it. I thought they were just showing you what it was for and how it would look, but it comes, it came with a beauty, a beauty blender, y'all. So that's pretty cool. 
Um, I mean, I don't know if beauty blenders are different, if they're better. If y'all know what I'm saying, I really don't know. So, I don't know if this is like a, if this is cool, if this is a good thing, or it's like a doo-doo one. I really, I don't know. Ooh, look at that camera work. But yeah, so I got that, and it came with one, so that's pretty cool. It feels different than the other one, though, so maybe not, but... Yeah, got this little case. I'm going to put my bigger one in there and probably just keep this in case I need another one or something. So, yeah, I'm going to just clean up a little bit, wrap some gifts, and watch some YouTube. Honestly, I need to catch up. I haven't been watching all my YouTube stuff. So, yeah. I figured y'all would enjoy watching this time lapse of me cleaning this island off because it looks a mess. So, hope y'all enjoy. Okay, I just finished wrapping the gifts. And I wrapped another one. I forgot I had um, gift cards to wrap. So I wrapped some little gift cards. I wanna show y'all, that's so cute. So cute. It's so cute. So yeah. I feel like that's so extra that I put the tag on there, but whatever. But I wanna show y'all all the freaking gifts under here. Wasn't well, a lot, a lot, but it's a couple. It's a couple. Yeah, I'm starving, but when I say we need groceries so bad, like, we have nothing that matches, like, literally. We have eggs, but we don't have, I don't have no bread or nothing. I don't have no, uh, we have no breakfast meat. Like, well, we have, we have no meat. So I guess I'll make some coffee. Some coffee should hold me off, right? Okay, hey y'all, we're in the restroom now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put my perfume in this bottle. So I'm gonna show y'all. But yeah, I used to I used to have, I used to love Bath & Body Works, but I kind of got over it, honestly. And there's nothing wrong with Bath & Body Works, don't get me wrong. If I go to Bath & Body Works right now and I smell something I really like, I'm gonna get it. I don't care. Um, I'm not like, it's not a big deal to me to like have designer perfume. I don't have any designer perfume. Like I said, all I have is Marc Jacobs. I like how the Daisy Marc Jacobs smells. So my mom got me like a little gift set and they're these. It's like, I think four or five in there. <laughs> and they're these. If y'all can see. Yeah, they're like these little mini ones. So I don't even have a full bottle of like designer perfume. But I love this. This is Warmer Colors by Pink. It's vanilla and sunburst passion fruit. It smells so good. I love how this smells. I would never get over the smell. So I'm going to pour this in here. And it's probably going to be still some left over, but I don't care. I just have it right here in my little tray. I'll show y'all whenever I do it. But So I, I've been smelling a lot of perfumes lately, especially like getting some from my mom and my sister. I bought my mom one and I want that one for myself, um, but I bought it for her. So, you know. <laughs> that was one of her Christmas gifts, but um, I want one for myself. I want one for myself. Uh, the same one that I got her. It was Versace Bright Crystal. That one smells good. 
I really want black opium. That one smells really good. The YSL. Oh my gosh. Gucci floral. There's so many different types of bottles. I don't know which one. I smell one and it smells really good. I want whatever one I smell. Um, I'm trying to think what else. There's a... I know the brand. It's called Victor something. Uh, that brand has one that smells really good that I smelled at Sephora the other day. Um, trying to think. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and... It's a really small hole, so... Let me see if I can figure this out. I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. I literally went and sat down in front of the TV and drank my rest of my coffee and watched a video trying to while I try to get this open. But I like tore it up. Look at this, y'all. Yeah, so there's no more of this bottle. And it it's it's open and it's pouring out, but I don't know. Okay, it's already halfway full. Literally, this bottle is so small. Look how much not a lot came out of here. And there we go. It's so cute. Yay. Let me spray it just for once. Oh, that's a good mist. Wow. A good spray. So cool. I'm happy. I was getting scared because I thought I wasn't going to be able to do it. So I'm happy now. And then I have this tray here that I keep everything. I'm missing the cotton ball thing. It's in the living room. I was trying to take off my polish off my toes. It goes right there. But I have just like the regular stuff. But yeah, I have just like the regular stuff here. So I'm just gonna put that right there. I think that is so cute. Hello guys. I think I look so flushed right now. Update, it's a little later. Um not a little i'm lying it's a lot later uh, i think the last time i vlogged was like three four so it's seven now thank you so much for being here and watching my video i really really appreciate it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up uh, leave a comment below leave a comment below about anything uh check out my other videos on my channel subscribe so you can see all my future videos and i'll see you on the next video